I have some bad news about Doc Martens. So The Guardian put out an article saying that Doc Martin prices will rise for the second year in a row. Let's give it a read and I'll just give out my opinions about it. Dr. Martens is to set up the price of his boots by 6%. As it said, the cost of labor, energy, and supplies, including the bouncy soles and leather, has risen. The Northampton share base footwear group will increase the price for the second year in a row on the classic boots, which currently cost about £159, adding £10 to the price. The rise will come next autumn to reflect the higher production cost that the company has now locked in over the course of next year. Announcing its half-year result, Dr. Martin's revealed a disappointing 5% fall in pre-tax profit in the six months to 30 September, despite a 13% rise in sale. And as the company said, it will invest more in marketing, staff, and new stores. So Doc Martin boots are going to increase 6%. The example that they gave is 160 pounds, which is roughly $200. And for me, I mean, that's a lot for like the classic Doc Martin boots. Whenever I think of classic Doc Martin boots, I think of the 1460 smooth leather, which in American dollars is about 170. So I don't know which pair of boots that they're talking about or how much boots are costing in England, but $200, that's more the Jaden. I just bought the Jaden. So next year, if I would have waited to get a pair of Jaden, there would have been 200 and what, 12 bucks? about plus tax and all of that so yeah doc martens they're getting more and more expensive hopefully they get better as they're putting up the price also they talked about a five percent fall in profit but a 13 percent increase in sales meaning that obviously they're selling well but other departments are doing bad maybe the overhead or i don't know something in the background is not right so hopefully they can get this right and hopefully this is not the new normal of just always increasing increasing i know with the economy and everything things are changing so hopefully doc martens do take the right step and they don't hit a point where the boots become too expensive the firm said about 10 million pounds of sales expected during the period where delayed because of strike at the port in Felix store and staff shortage at its distribution center in the Netherlands. Kenny Wilson, the chief executive of Dr. Martin said he was very confident about our outlook for Christmas. He said the group was still seeing inflations in the cost of the supplies across the board from the oil-based products used to make the soles to the leather and energy we would only put the price up to cover inflation. This year, we put the price up for the first time in two years and will cover inflation next year. Wilson added, staff costs are rising. Dr. Martens is offering a 500 pound cost of living bonus paid out over October and November to about 2,000 of his 3,500 workers across the world. The payment will go to staff who work at least 20 hours a week and earn less than an equivalent to 45,000 pounds a year. From the UK factory and the head office to buying teams in US, Europe, South Korea, and Bangladesh. Wilson said the company was making payments as its workers were facing very tough levels of inflation. At the end of the day, people are the differentiator. We have a highly engaged workforce and wanted to show we cared for people who work for Doc Martens. And actions speak louder than words. Okay, so there is a shortage in one of their distribution center in the Netherlands. And I don't know whose fault it was. I tried to do some more research. I couldn't find anything online. I even checked the dark web. Like literally, I was trying to find information about what happened and there was nothing about it. So that was a big thing that they had to deal with this year, which they lost a lot of money. I mean, the CEO said that around Christmas, everybody shops around Christmas, so they're gonna make a big profit and hopefully that can help. Another thing that the CEO was saying, he put like a bunch of motivational things, you know, things that you expect people to say. I'm just hoping that he does what he was saying, how you put people first, you try to help the workers so that this will not happen again, because I'm sure if the price keep increasing, slowly but surely, 
they're going to lose customers and things like that. Or we don't know what's ahead in the future. I understand everything is becoming more and more expensive, but I don't know how to combat it because I'm sure things over there is becoming more and more expensive just to make shoes and things like that. But I just hope that they figure it out. I'm not in that position to make decisions or to call anything, but I hope that what the CEO is saying, you know, people first, they need to take actions or louder than words, things like that. I hope that they can do that. And I hope, you know, the brand keeps improving because each and every year, if you look at the numbers, they do make more money each and every year. My last words are just, they're trying to improve different aspects of the brand, the marketing and things like that. So hopefully, I mean, they get to work with more people outside of their norm, let's just say that. And I hope this price increase is not their new norm. You know, they're always increasing price and things like that. Doc Martens, they don't market themselves as like a luxurious boot company, you know? At first it was more of that rebellious thing, which became cool for a lot of individuals and a lot of people do like it. So yeah, hopefully they can figure it out. And uh, yeah, I made this channel just to talk about Doc Martens because I like them. I like video, I like the edit and things like that. So hopefully one day I can work with them. I don't know, do something that helps me help you. I don't know, affiliate link or anything that I can do to help others. But yeah, hopefully Doc Martens, I mean, they figure it out. And this is not the new normal. That's my big thing. Because if this becomes the new normal, then it's going to be a little bit crazy. I hope they can figure it out. Let me know your opinions down below.